Now, given the high rate of accidents in our country, car manufacturers do place a lot of emphasis on passenger safety. But what kind of research and development goes into making that vehicle extra safe? So we're here at the crash test center of Tata Motors here in Pune, the first to be set up in India to help you understand the different components of safety inside your vehicle. The Crash Safety Center was inaugurated in 1997 and was indigenously designed and built by Tata Motors. As inside any lab, you do get to see lots of advanced equipment sourced from leading global suppliers and this center is involved in development of passenger and commercial vehicles and buses in India and export markets. Currently, a team of nearly 200 work at this center. Now, it's interesting to note that even before the first full sketch of the car is made, the designers are given a very detailed mandate by the safety engineers in terms of the different components, safety components that go inside the car. From the location of the different crumple zones to the various components that are inside the car, the safety mandate is very, very important. And so the designers have a very tough job to include all those components but still come out with a very good looking car. Now this rigid wall here at the crash test center of Tata Motors is basically to understand the frontal accident kind of scenarios and the damage to the vehicle that happens as a result of it. Uh, now this is where two vehicles are not on a full-on head-on collision kind of scenario but more trying to avoid each other but they still crash into each other and you can see the kind of energy absorption strictly to the front. The rest of the car is completely intact, the structure is completely intact. Also interesting to note is that there are 150 sensors placed at different parts of the car to understand the true impact of the crash. In a frontal crash test, crumple zones absorb crash energy and cushions passenger compartment, reducing shock levels. Also, a strong passenger compartment and a good and non-jamming door design ensure safety and quick evacuation of occupants in a crash. Of course, it's also important that fuel leakage and electric shock risks are looked at to avoid fire post-accidents. Now, it's always heartbreaking to see scratches appear on your car, but when you're driving on Indian roads, it's inevitable that you will find a few scratches, whether you're driving or even park the car. Uh, but is it advisable or is it a better value for money to take it to your neighborhood mechanic to do a quick fix solution with a quick paint job or actually take it to a company authorized service station who, which might cost you a little bit more but might just be worth it. So let's go find out. Minor dents and a scratch on your car can be an eyesore often decrease its resale value and be the possible source of rust in your car. You wouldn't want that, especially in your new car, right? So to understand how this can be treated, we reached a Hyundai authorized workshop in Chennai. The latest paintless dent removal or PDR technique is followed to remove unsighty dents and dings from the car. The process involves special tools behind the bodywork to gently massage out the dent from the panel without damaging the paint. First, the dent is cut to the second paint layer of the car and then an electric gun is used to ensure proper levelling is done. Soon after, the primer is applied to ensure the dent is covered and finally the paint job is done. So how much does this cost in an authorized dealership? Depending on the car and the dent, the price varies. A small dent like this could cost close to 3500 rupees and it goes up to about 12000 rupees. The costs are reduced to almost half in a non-authorized car workshop. But also the quality goes for a toss. And of course there is no PDR technique used here. The usual heating of the panel and then treating the dent. This could cause damage to your car paint. Thank you. 
Back at the Tata Motor Crash Test Center, we are looking at processes of car safety testing including this hydraulic sled test facility that is used for development of seat belts, airbags and interior components. Also a car body strength test facility tests all systems and structures meant for car occupant safety. From seat belts to side door strength to roof structures, this facility looks to recreate a real world crash environment.